July 31st, 2011. Here we are in Milford for the first annual Bass College Kids Fishing Tournament. We got all our kids here. They got their rods. We got some worms. We're going to head back here to fish this pond and hopefully catch a bunch of fish. But most important, we're going to have fun, right? Yeah. That didn't sound fun. Are we going to have fun? Yeah. Yeah, have fun. All right, we'll see you in a few minutes with some fish. Let's go, guys. Okay, I'm already starting. Now, why don't everybody get their rod? Jeremy has the first fish. Good job. First fish. Dover Bass Club. First fish. Well, that's a nice looking fish, isn't it? Okay, second one for that. Jeremy. Dover Bass Club's got two bat, two fish. Two fish for Jeremy. What's up, Kurt got up there? Vinny's running over here with the scale now. Keep track of how many they catch, too. Okay, this is Ryan Smith. Uh, he works here at the Delaware Veterans Home. He's our site member, and he's the one that uh, told us about the location and helped us out with the kids' tournament here and uh, got it all started. So we want to thank Ryan for that. He's going to go to work here in a few minutes, so he's going to check everybody out and help with the kids for a minute, and then he's got to run on in here and work with the veterans. So we wanted to thank him for that, and we appreciate all your help. He's tight. This is his fourth one. He's caught four fish. He caught three bluegills, and he's got the first bass of the day. It's not a giant, but so far it's the biggest one, Edge. All right, congratulations. Now Let's go get some more. So you can catch it again. How many we got over here now? This is Ryan's third one. Edge has four. Samari still hasn't caught one. He keeps losing his worm. I don't know why. Now Kurt, how are the glasses working out for you by Bass Glass Eyewear, the new HD uh, glasses that we got from them? They work great. Very, very good. Great. Is the, are they really super clear? And uh, they're 100% UVA, UBB, and uh, polarized, and uh, they've got the HD lenses on them in the amber color. So you should be able to really see well under the water and stuff. I normally only use Coast of Del Mars, but with these I've been very happy. It's the closest thing I've found to, to that just as well. I just Show them the, the Yeah, nice. those are nice glasses, aren't they? Very nice. All right, we want to thank our sponsor, Bass Glass Eyewear, for helping us uh, put this uh, tournament on and uh, giving all the pro staff the uh, HD glasses. Uh, we really yeah, appreciate 12 that. 12 or 15 bluegills right in front of you. Down here is a big bass. They're not big, but nice sized. Yeah, there's one down there. Well, I love her, but I love the fish. Um, I spend all day out on this go. lake. Hell is all I catch. But today she met me at the door. Said I would have to choose If I hit that fishing hole today She'd be packing all her things And she'd be gone by noon I'm gonna miss her When I get home Right now I'm on this lake shore And I'm Sitting in the sun, I'm sure you hit me When I walk through that door tonight I'm gonna miss her Look at there, another bite Got a bass, he just caught a bass about the same size So those two are the first, they're The two smallest kids are in first place in second place Nobody catches any more big ones. You can give him the first place trophy. He don't care. Edge won't care. Here, Edge. They're about the same size. Though. That 10 inch. Yeah. yeah. That's two biggest I've seen so far. Well, there is. There are big yeah, ones at the pier. Okay. 
Now, who's that that just caught one? What's your name? Jacob. Jacob. That's nice. That's their nice bluegills. Now, how many got Jacob? How many that? Uh, Fifteen. Fifteen. That's pretty good, Tom, huh? Yeah, it is. They're smoking. Sam, seventeen. So, Tom, uh, tell them a little bit about your uh, glasses. Do you like the HD glasses? Yeah, these are the ones from the bass eyewear. Bass glass eyewear. Yeah, um, I like now, You have the one, uh, I think, 179 model. Right. And I have the 188s on. Right. Real super crystal clear. You can really see everything. Cuts the glare. UVA, UVB, polarized, but it's in HD. Right. We were showing the kids, letting them use the glasses. They couldn't see the fish. We, we get, let the kids use the glasses. They put them on while they see them. Really nice glasses. Awesome for the price. You just click through on the site when you see the Bass Glass Eyewear banner. You can click on the banner or go into our link section. And there's even a separate write-up on it in the form. They've got new glasses coming in too now that aren't the HD in all different styles with the uh, mirrored lenses and right. everything and like Jose that. And Jose actually says they have the, um, the um, cover overs for prescription glasses. Last time I spoke to him, he had a few pair left. I guess he's getting more in, but um, great glasses for the money. That's second pair. Oh, he's down digging in the mill foil. Oh, nice one, Edge. Edge Meister. Oh, keep running. Keep going. That drag can't handle it. Walk back. Walk back up the hill. Keep walking. Good job, bud. Right in the corner of his mouth, too. Look at that. Yeah, nice fast, Edge. Edge, you're really catching nice them, aren't you? That's Edge's second bass. Give that to him. Give me five, buddy. You having fun? Hold him. Here, I'll hold your rod. Let him hold it. No, it won't. <laughs> Remember, like you held the four pounder. Hold him. Put your hand there. He has no teeth. Squeeze tight. Yeah, they don't have any teeth. Hold Look at that, Edge. Look at the camera. Hold him. Wow. Nice. All right, buddy. Look at that. Another decent bass. Now, how'd you catch him? Um, we just saw him. I was going to try to catch a bluegill, but and we saw him cast it out, but then I saw him just swimming around. That's See, perfect. then I got a And he actually, he actually hit the worm then, huh? That's yeah, the he just chased after him real fast and then oh, all right, um, you got the measurer to measure him up? It, yeah. Okay, we're going to measure him up and then so we'll far, see if we can get caught a ton of fish. Here. Most kids have caught anywhere between 10 to 20 each. Some a little bit more. Just every cast, if you can keep up with the bait long enough. A lot of, a lot of bluegills. Uh, right now, we got Edge over here. He's got one that was 14 and a quarter. Sam has one that is 13 inches. And what's the little boy over there? His father, Jeremy. Jeremy from the Dover Bass Club. Got Bob, the third yeah. biggest one so far that I've seen. So there's your top three. For now. For now, but there's still more fish. All right. First, let's all thank our parents for bringing you guys out here to fish, right? In this heat. Sitting here while it's hot, that wasn't loud enough. Say thank you louder. Thank you. Did everybody have a good time? Yes. Good. We caught lots of fish. It was a lot of little bluegills. We had three guys caught bass. Jeremy, what's your last name, Jeremy? Who are you? Drago. 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 How big was this fish? Uh, okay, but it was a bass. So you get to third place. Yes. Here's your trophy, buddy. You gotta get a plaque. Yeah. Right. Oh, right here, Here, Jeremy. Third place, Jeremy, Dover Bass Club. In second place, this, what's your last name? Sam Baker in second place with a 13 inch bass. And with a 14 inch bass, Edge caught this, caught a 14 inch bass. Here you go, buddy. Now, how many fish did you catch? All right, Edge. Edge Von Brandt. Jason, what? 
for the most fish, Jason. There's a rod, buddy. Ryan, here's a certificate for you, buddy. Hold on, we're going to give out some more prizes here. Here's a certificate for you. Mara, here's a certificate for you. All right. Shirts, right? Whatever, whoever wears the so, right, that size, they just go ahead and just give them out. Here's a shirt for Jacob Baker. Bass College. Bass College shirt. We got another small. Let's see here. Size shirt. You gotta get all the kids up here. Take that. You don't have this. All right. Yep. Shirts. It's a medium. Now we got some free lures. Everybody come up here and get some lures. Now you already got some. There's ten bags of them, so there should be one for everybody. A bunch of extra bags. Hey Steve, you want to give these bottles and hook? Yes. Come here, Jeremy. I got a, I got a bug bait. And here, hey. here's some bobbers and hooks. I gave the buzzer. Your dad can take the fish and the hook. Got it all back. Yeah, buddy. That's good, the rage tails. They're good. Here, bud. Some bobbers and hooks. Some worms. What do you think? What did you get? <laughs> all right, all we got to do, we got to get a picture, guys. Let's, let's all get them together with your prize. Let's get everybody standing here. Let me get the big kids in the back. Right. Come here, buddy. Stand here. We got to smile. So what are we going to do to make you guys smile? Let's say we got to look at Mr. Steve. Mr. Steve has smelly armpits. Smile. Right, on three, we're going to say Mr. Steve has smelly armpits. One, two, three. Mr. Steve has smelly armpits. Smile. Smile. All right, guys, thank you guys for coming. Again, thank your parents again. They sat out here while it was hot. Okay, uh, that was a great uh, tournament. We had uh, fun at our first annual Bass College Kids Tournament here in Milford, Delaware. We want to thank all our sponsors uh, for making this possible. We want to thank Grandy Bass, Jerry Sheen of Grandy Bass Trophy Hunter Baits. Uh, always a pleasure to do business with them. And Dirty Jigs, uh, we'd like to thank uh, Faculty of Fishing, Terry McClymont, for all the fishing courses and the discounts he offers to all our members and all the specific courses that are really helping people out, they say. Uh, we want to say special thanks to him. We want to thank uh, Tom Baker, who was a major contributor and helped a lot uh, with the tournament. Uh, we want to thank uh, Ryan Smith, who works here at the Veterans Home, for finding this course and helping us put this on. And of course, uh, Alan uh, Rossberger uh, and Vinny Rossetti and our pro staff administrator here, Tom Wolfman. So, and of course, Kurt Bumbrand, he's always here. That's the Philly Cat that you see running around in the background. And I'd also like to thank um, Band Place Highway. Thanks for the for the glasses. Um, we all love them. We actually let the kids use them. They, they were seeing it. Fish in the water, great glass. So, how do you think the tournament went, Tom? It went good. Kids caught a lot of fish. I've seen kids with over 25 bluegills. We got three bass, two over 10, 12, 14 inches. They had a good time. The only thing next year, I think we're going to do it a little cooler weather. Yeah, a little too hot for the kids today. But we all had to cut a little short because uh, the humidity is like 95 percent. We're pushing 98 degrees for the temperature. That's a lot for little kids. So we hope everybody enjoyed it. I thank again all our sponsors. Thank everybody for coming, and we'll see you all down on the water. See you at the Potomac.